Hello, it's Grandma Jackie. I'm back again with another Dollar Tree haul. I want to try to finish what I got, but we will see. I just, I just did one. So if you see the same shirt, um, and it was like 20 plus minutes long, and I was pretty yakky. So I'm going to try not to yak so much this time. Thank you all so much for joining me. I appreciate your time, and let's get started. There's a lot. <laughs> okay, so I had a recipe here while back. Here go, here I go, talking, talking. I had a recipe here while back, and it called for cream of chicken. I went to Walmart and couldn't find cream of chicken anywhere. So I found it at the Dollar Tree. So I got two cans of the cream of chicken. I also picked up a can of cream of mushroom because I feel like this is kind of comparable to Walmart. Sometimes, like in the past, you'd be able to find it and catch a sale on it, but probably not anymore. Then I also picked up a thing, a manwich. All the dates in, on these are really good. I always look at that first thing. This one is December of 2024. Um, the cream of mushroom date on it is August of 2024. And the cream of chickens are June of 2024. There's that. Then I found these and I got several of them because I thought, oh, my husband will like them too. He does like them. I don't care for them. But these are the Snickers iced coffee and the Twix iced coffee. I just, I don't know. It does taste kind of like a Snickers, but I figured out I don't like to drink a Snickers. <laughs> if that makes sense. And it, it probably will make sense to some of you guys. I don't like drinking Snickers. Then I just picked up one of the pumpkin spice. I'm not a big fan of pumpkin spice, but I do like pumpkin. So I just picked up one. <clears throat> then I picked up one of these V8 Sparkling Energy Strawberry Kiwis. I do like the V8 drinks. Even um, the V8s that are not tomato juice. That probably makes sense to people too. Surely I make sense, but I just picked up one of those two. And then I got two of these. They were the Halloween trees. I tried to pick ones that weren't smashed because once they're smashed, like, you can't really do much about it. So I picked ones that had a not smashed side. They're like a Halloween tear tray type of thing I don't know and then I picked up one of these I don't really decorate a whole lot for Halloween not like I do fall and Christmas as I'm pour, pulling out more Halloween stuff um, I got three of these bat tree toppers I, I don't think I'm gonna do like a Halloween tree I mean I might I don't know but I got these more or less for a wreath they are metal bats. And then I also got these little LED skull lights. Upside down. And some pumpkins, which are super cute. They give me the candy corn vibes. So I got three of those. When I pick up stuff, I kind of try to tend to either most likely pick it up in threes but sometimes I surprise myself so I also got this little pumpkin and it's a little it says thankful now a few years back I made my own little cloth pumpkins and put pieces of little wood in it I still have them I don't know that I decorated with them this year but I thought this was, you know, really cute. I like the plaid type on it. That. A couple of signs that I, like, fell in love with. I don't really do signs, and if I do them, I'll only do them for the one year. Um, but some, some I've kept for a few years, but I like this one. I thought that was really cute, and I like how it's, like, like this part here looks like it's 3D, but it's not. It's flat, but these are 
raised up if you can see and then this part right here has a little bit of glitter to it so I kind of really like that I think it looked good over a doorway this one I love I love the colors I love the saying I love it enough that I feel like I have to DIY some sort of frame for this so I can keep it for many years um, it says family makes this house a home and I love love the colors the only thing that's kind of weird to me <laughs> I have to point it out then you guys won't be able to unsee it but like the house like these pumpkins are huge next to the house and this little canister thing is huge compared to the house so I don't know but I do love it so I'm gonna try to do something along the lines of a frame to put it in to keep it to pull it out with my decorations every year okay so here comes another story the other day on TikTok, I learned how to blow gas under your arms with a straw. There's no other way to say it. Hold on just a moment. I think my husband's home. Yeah, hold on. So anyways, <laughs> it works best with the little straws that have the bendy things. And I've taught my grandkids how to do it. A couple of them so far. I'm going to teach the rest, and it's hilarious, and it's fun. So, that's what I got those straws for. Absolutely not for drinking, for having fun. <laughs> and then I got these two little bow curly things because they caught my eye, and I think birthday's coming up. They look good on a present. A Crayola. 3D foam puzzle and bath bomb to go with my Crayola gift baskets that I'm working on. If they'd have had more than one of these, I would have gotten because I think this is pretty cool. And Charlotte has seen this on the table and picked it up several times. So I think she's going to, you know, be interested in getting the one that's in that basket. <clears throat> I did pick up a couple paper clips. Probably not a very good deal, but they were cute. I can make my own paper clips for much cheaper, but I did it. Then I want to show you some of these little guys. You know how they had the little game controller water things? They have these now. Look at You can work on trying to get it in there. Anyways, they had the yellow. They had this light blue or purpley. This is the light blue. And then they have the pink. So I picked up one of each color that I found. A couple more minutes and then I gotta get off of here because I've got to go. Um, I got a Star Wars tablecloth that has the child on it. And that's a Dollar Tree. Interesting. Very interesting. So I picked up a couple of DVDs. This is The Legend of Hallowayan. I don't know if that's how it's... I keep these in the van. Because we have one of those DVD players in the van for grandkids. This is Mission to the Moon Where No Duck Has Gone Before. And this one's for me. I found this at the Dollar Tree. Um, Rampage. DVD. Blu-ray. Oh, I've seen that in the high definition in the movie theater when it first came out. Oh, that was really good. I got three more of these. I'm on the search for these for staff at work, probably for Christmas, because this is the emojis is what I did the CNA weekend, but I kind of want to continue to do something around Christmas time. This my husband wanted. He's going to do something with it, I suppose. A little ball of cap thing. Um, reusable water balloons. It's a two-pack. Ages five and up. Not sure about this. But you're supposed to feel, seal, throw, and repeat. So 
So I'm sure that will be an interesting thing to put in with the Grimmel Fun Basket. I know somebody will love it. There. Okay. Then I got this little weekly pad, whatever. It says Hello Gorgeous. It's for 2024. Um, is what it says. But to me, I didn't see any dates. So you can use it for whenever. So I picked that up. Because I'm also jotting stuff down, writing stuff. So I got some stickers. Um, Frozen. And My Little Pony. These will probably go on Lila's desk for surprises. And I just want to show a couple more things. I got this. I think I've purchased this before. And it's in with the Crayola stuff already. This art. Full color poster. 28 pages. Got the child. I got that. And then, totally off center of that, is these Halloween leather. This is new. I don't know what I'm going to do with it. But I got two. One of each kind that I saw. Yes. <laughs> so anyways, thank you all so much for joining me. I'm going to get off here and I we need to take a trip. And I hope you guys are having a great day. Please stay safe, take care, and I'll catch you later.